from this point over is all locked up. Significant progress on the new Emory and Henry Fieldhouse is grabbing attention across campus. The Fieldhouse is quickly taking shape and noticeable features can be seen with the recent development of the building. Well, being in construction for 30 years, uh, usually you don't get as good weather as we have right now for the uh, winter time to be able to go up as quickly as we are. So yes, we are um, ecstatic that the Fieldhouse is going up as quickly as it is. Burwell is the construction company in charge of the project. And they've made so much progress in these last few months that even if the great winter weather does not remain, construction on the building will continue. We're at a pretty good point at this part of the construction. So if we get some adverse weather, we do have other things that we can go to. So as far as shutting the job down, I, it would have to be really severe to shut the job down at this point. The field house will be a two-story building, each floor being over 7,000 square feet. The main floor will hold the football locker room, training room, as well as the equipment room. The second floor will have an observational deck that will overlook the field on Saturdays. We'll also hold an alumni room, the coaches offices, and classrooms. The observational deck is one of the most anticipated features of the new Emory and Henry field house. And although we don't know who will be allowed to be up here, as you can see, it's going to be one of the best views in Division III college football. The field house will also be a big draw for incoming football recruits, as well as have a major impact on the football program at Emory & Henry. Uh, you, you can stand underneath the scoreboard and take a look across there. You can just imagine what that's going to be like on a Saturday afternoon. So I just, I, it's nothing but positive things coming up for the Wasps. As construction continues, anticipation builds on the Emory & Henry campus for the new field house. Drew Piscopo, EHC-TV.